welcome, welcome back to another episode here on the single player survival let's play. Uh, today I'm actually putting our sheep farm to use already using a wool color that I thought I never would have. I almost even, instead of building the three extras, just x brown out uh, as one of the colors. And uh, here I am using it. Uh, so I've got kind of a new style for the interiors that I've developed. Um, and I want to work on that today. Uh, let me show you the one that I've already done. Uh, I've actually done the interior to this these two builds. Uh, they're connected just like that. those two are. Uh, just like this. Okay. Um, so yeah. So I'm bringing in acacia. Uh, and I'm using like, you know, a different color for acacia. It's been edited. Uh, and I like this so much more. It still has that orangish reddish tone. Uh, but it is so much more usable. It isn't so bright and like doesn't yell at you pretty much. Um, but yeah. This is kind of the style I'm going for for interiors, and this is the floor I want to do. Uh, so, you know, just brown concrete powder, spruce, uh, brown wool, carpets, this torch is under the carpet, stuff like that. And, uh, yeah, and then we're getting our two mines and stuff are down in that way. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, done that, and uh, still got to do these interiors, but I thought that I would finish off our actual storage house that we did two episodes ago uh, and do its interior. So I've got a bunch of chests and stuff, uh, about four stacks of oak logs for these. And uh, yeah, I'm going to do the interior of this, but let's see if we can work something out together. So I think I, let's go like this. I think it was something along those lines. Right here in the middle will probably be, actually, I think we should off center the lights so that they're here and here. So let's get, where's the brown wool at? A couple carpets. There we go. And let's see what we can do here. Oh yeah, that, that comes out perfect with what we were doing. Sweet, okay. And then we could probably go for this here. Nope. Oh wait, yeah, just like that. And like so, cool, cool, cool. And then we'll bring in the spruce everywhere else. Nice. But I think I'm going to switch these out in the middle for the stairs. Like so. Kind of like I did on the other one. Just to add a little bit more uh, flavor to it, I guess you could say. And really, I could do these two. But I don't think I'm going to. Because we already have a stair right here. So how's that look? Looks sweet. Uh, yeah, just kind of a combination of blocks I never would have used, uh, really. Like, I wouldn't, I feel like with just spruce and brown concrete powder, it would have just been weird. But when you just have two, but if you add the third, then it actually becomes a style of its own, I think. So, yeah. Sorry if you can hear I'm a little congested. I actually uh, went skiing in Utah with some old friends I met online. Yes, but I knew them for four years. Uh, Evolve Platinum, they're in some of my older, older videos, I think, if you go on back. Sorry about that, uh, my dog was barking, I had to stop there for a second. Uh, but yeah, I went out skiing in Utah with some buds that I met online, and, uh, it was a lot of fun. I had a ton of fun, uh, doing that. And, uh, yeah. So, this video is probably going to be a day late, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, a as of recording this, it is New Year's, it's January 1st, so, uh, happy 2020, everybody. Uh, I forgot to grab buttons, um, but yeah, but anyways, guys, I think the plan for today's episode is to, uh, fight the end dragon, uh, and uh, get elytra and some shulker shells and stuff, because soon we're going to move, be moving on to a new area, and having a lot of shulker shells is going to help a lot with that, and, uh, I think I've got, you know, a place to put shulker shells right in here with chests on either side, and chests here, and shulker shells here, and chests here, and, uh, yeah. Just like so. So, I'm going to get to work on doing this interior, and then we will head out and find the stronghold. See you guys then. Alright guys, I finished up our interior here. Uh, I've got probably going to put like a bedroom, or maybe I'll just leave it like this for now. I'll put like acacia here, um, and uh, <clears throat> maybe we can come to this uh, some other time. Uh, we can do it like that, I guess. I feel like it would be a pro no, okay, because we have that there. Um, but yeah, we can come, and uh, if we need bulk storage, we can go there, or maybe a bedroom or something. Um, but yeah, so here's what I've got on this side. 
Uh, I'm gonna have three shulker boxes uh, up there and up here. Uh, that's a stair so I can open the chest. And then I've got three furnaces on this side uh, for just a little bit of smelting. I'll probably build a super smelter like somewhere eventually. Uh, but yeah, we've just got this right here for now. And uh, maybe I'll trade like up top, make one of them like a smoker and the other two like the metal things or vice versa. I'm not really sure. Uh, but I could also line shulker boxes up here and here and here. You know, it doesn't really matter. I just wanted to leave the windows open in this original design. Uh, but that can change eventually if we need it to. Uh, but yeah, uh, my inventory is kind of a mess. Uh, I need to repair my pick. Uh, so I need going to go do that. And uh, then we are going to set out and find the stronghold. That's really a boring process. And I'm sure everyone has seen it a million times now. Uh, at this point of, you know, Minecraft being out for 10 years. So... No, I'm going to do that maybe not like that, um, but I'm just going to do that off camera and then I will show you guys whenever we're at the stronghold and we will defeat the ender dragon together. Uh, I made a brewing stand, but I didn't really have a place to put it, uh, but maybe we can put it in here actually. Eh, there we go. Good enough for me. Now we've got a brewing stand somewhere if we ever need one, which we probably won't because I never use potions, but I'm going to head out, look for the stronghold. Uh, I need, is my bow in here? Is this my good bow? Yeah, okay, that's good. Uh, so yeah, um, we're gonna head out for the stronghold and I will show you guys when we're there. All right, we've made it to the stronghold, as you guys can tell, after about an eh, hour and a half of searching for this stupid room. Uh, we finally found it, and uh, I believe there's two libraries here. I'm going to come back. I got some books, which I really should not have, uh, but we'll come back for the rest of the bookcases and stuff with a Soak Touch Axe, because uh, I wasted, like, a lot of wood, you know? Um, but, yeah, I think we're all ready. I've got some buckets of water and some stuff. Uh, now, if I fall into the void, I'm going to be, be very mad, because this is god armor. Um, but, yeah, I think we're ready. Uh, we got good bow. A uh, re really good sword, like a god sword, I think. And uh, let's take this guy on. Okay, bad start. Uh, what I think I'm going to do is this is going to be kind of like a little montage of me killing the dragon. So I will see you guys when the fight is all over. Enjoy the clips. I don't know what to do, because as you can probably tell, I think we got pretty fucked up here. What the heck? There's no portal! What the heck? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Okay, cut to me figuring out what I'm gonna do. Alright, so that... Uh, was not a mistake. That's just how our end generated here. Um, so I went into game mode and I pretty much set block portals in every single one of these and then, you know, surrounded it with bedrock to make look at I, this. I don't even think this is the right size, but you know, whatever. Um, we kind of got, you know, fucked up there. Uh, like, we couldn't really help that. The only way we could fix it was to go into game mode. So that's what we did. And uh, yeah.
So now, uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go find an in city, and I'm gonna go in raiding for you know quite a while uh, up over here. So I will uh, see you guys when we find a city. It'll probably uh, be a while, but we're gonna go uh, in raiding for like a while, like a while, while um, until we get like a ton of shulker boxes and at least uh, two elytra, at least two elytra. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys then. I took shaders off uh, just you know because I can see without fog, and we found one, and it's also, yeah, a gateway right there, uh, and there's a ship, so I might get an elytra, uh, raid the city, and be done, actually, I might do that, uh, I might not, it depends on how many shulkers I get, uh, but I'm gonna leave it running, uh, uh, for this, and we are going to bust this together, um, I might cut in and out as well, like I did for the fight, uh, not really sure yet, just depends on how it goes, how boring it is, how boring it may be, isn't and that one's lost because it teleported somewhere come on there we go give it give it to me oh come on where'd this other one go give me these there it is she should be like a one hit now yeah come on fall thank you and rods are awesome okay let's get a bunch of these Ow. So, uh, I found this. It's like the most lame thing ever, but I guess it works. And then, coming up here, I also found another one. And there is a ship over there, I saw it. Or at least I think there is. So, that's three Elytra. So, uh, I'm gonna grab these two other Elytra, and then we're gonna head on back to base. So, I'll see you guys there. So, uh, I found another one. With another ship, <laughs> I kind of don't want to find them anymore. I've been looking for a gateway for 30 minutes since the last one. So, yeah, I just really want to go back home and build some. But I guess we got to do some more of these. So I'm at the top of this one. And you've got to be kidding me. Really. Another ship. I think that's five Elytra now? Maybe six. Actually, the front of this got cut off, so no Elytra. But we do have that one. And it's full, it looks like, so gonna head over there. All right, we are back and let's look at the hall. We've got quite a bit of stuff. That's two elytra and no shulker shells in this one. That's no elytra in this one, but a full stack of shulker shells. Plus, you know, let's, let's take the diamonds as well. And then an elytra in here. Wait, am I missing? Yeah, there's one, okay. And then how many shulker shells? 17 in here plus these three boxes we are set if i ever have to go in busting again i swear i'm gonna lose it i just spent six hours doing that guys so uh hopefully we're good for like the rest of this world on shulker boxes and i swear if we ever run out i'm duping them i'm making an item duper and i'm duping them i hate in busting probably it's one of like my least favorite things to do in the game like i go you have to do it i mean if you ever want to get a light and fly Literally like a must-have if you want shulker boxes, which as a builder, you kind of need both of those. So, yeah. Uh, I've done that, so now I'm going to try and finish off the episode back here at the base working some. I want to get all this stuff taken out of here and moved into our, uh, our storage area that we built two episodes ago. And then I will come back and we will finish thing off the episode there. Alright, ladies and gents, I think I have got everything moved into our storage house and I've got it all labeled with item frames and stuff uh, I'll probably put bulk cobblestone in there and I've got 
a little bit of space over here still left but this is really more like items and then like building blocks and stuff are over here so yeah got all of our wood types we can have jungle here but we're probably never gonna have jungle wood because i don't like it uh but we'll have it there if we need it and then you know dirt and your gravity blocks like gravel and the concrete powders sand uh maybe eventually i'll put concrete powder and concrete here but as of now there's no need i've got lighting right there and then coming back over here again we've got like all of our tools potions and stuff uh weapons tools uh horse armor i'll probably throw some saddles in there as well these are like other types of tools like shears and buckets and flint and steel this is like your utility items i think and then uh passive mob drops hostile mob drops uh, bones and bone meal and then this is kind of like agriculture these are saplings and then your dyes and books and bookcases so yeah uh, I quite like it I really like how this place looks as well uh, I think it did a good job with it but yeah that's all we have for this episode next episode uh, is going to be a fun one because uh, we are going to be killing the wither I thought it you know go, go Get our two bosses done back to back. Hey, there's a drowned. That's like the first drowned I've seen, I swear. And how are you not... Oh, I guess he's in the water. I thought they had to be in the shade, though, for them not to drown. Guess not. Let's kill this guy. Alright, there we go. Uh, but yeah. Uh, next episode, we are killing the wither. Just got 40 levels. Um, we're gonna kill the wither, and because I want to have a beacon for haste, too. So between this episode and next episode, it's probably gonna be like a full week's time for me. Because I have to get a ton of mining done. I have to get a ton of iron uh, for that. So I'm going to be working on that. So uh, once that's all, you know, I got enough iron, I'll probably start working on the next episode. We're going to kill the wither and then we're going to build an underground mob farm. Uh, mainly for the gunpowder from creepers, but it'll also be good to have a ton of bones and stuff like that. I could use it around and flush the trade with villagers, I guess. Uh, but yeah strength spiders we're going to be doing all that we're going to make a nice design that's going to work in 1.14.4 and hopefully 1.15 in future versions uh would be nice as well but yeah so i got a little bit of research and a lot of mining to do uh before the next episode starts so if you enjoyed this episode hit the like button if you really enjoyed it feel free to subscribe comment down below let me know what you think uh and remember we're not going to be doing really any building next episode it's really just going to be a lot of grindy work like uh digging stuff and building a mob farm and uh, i'll probably kill the wither in the beginning for a bit of excitement at the start of the episode so i will see you guys then my name is dash and as always thanks for watching what the...